whether this might be the solution to one of the great mysteries of the solar system. Scientists suspect that the young Mars was in many ways an Earth-like place, with a thick atmosphere and oceans which may have harbored primitive life. But then, around four billion years ago, the planet entered a catastrophic decline. Gradually, the atmosphere and oceans of Mars mysteriously disappeared. The puzzle was, where did the water go? What process could have caused the loss of water? Mario realized that two dramatic events in the early history of Mars might lead him to the answer. We found two very large impact bases in the southern hemisphere of Mars, which are Hellas and Argyr. There was absolutely no magnetization over them. In these basins, formed when two huge meteorites hit Mars, the rocks were strikingly free of magnetism. And that was odd, because the huge impacts must have melted the crust. And as it cooled again, the rocks should have become magnetized by the strong Martian magnetic field. Yet, there was no trace of magnetism in Hellas and Argyre. Which immediately meant that they were formed after the magnetic field of Mars has ceased to exist. And the estimate is that these impacts took place more than four billion years ago. Four billion years ago is when Mars was beginning to lose its water and atmosphere. Though not all scientists agree with him, Mario is convinced that the timing is not just a coincidence. If we shut down the magnetic field, then the solar wind has direct access to the atmosphere of Mars. Then we have a process which is equivalent to the erosion in a desert. The wind blows and it blows the sand away. In this case, the sand are atmospheric particles. Slowly but surely, the atmospheric gases, which includes water, are carried away and are lost to Mars. The loss of its magnetic shield could well have meant death for the red planet. Exposed to the wind of radiation from the sun, over millions of years, its atmosphere was gradually blown away, leaving the sterile world we see today. If we were to turn off the Earth's magnetic field, the same process would occur. Uh, the atmosphere of Earth would be exposed to the erosional effects of the solar wind, and it would be slowly carried away. The fate of Mars suggests that without the protection of its magnetic shield, the Earth could also become a dead planet. Which makes it all the more disturbing to learn that our own magnetic field is fading so rapidly.